Okay, my friends. So what we're in here in this keeping track sheet is we're literally just keeping track of how many times 15 showed up as that next Powerball and how many times it didn't. So if you look over here, uh, when you were clicking over here and, and the Powerballs were coming through, over in this sheet, it was keeping track. So right now, as of this moment, I've seen 15 10 times and I haven't seen 15 388. If I click over here again, Okay, it's not 15, which means 388 goes up to 389. Kind of fun. I also put a clicker here in case you want to keep clicking through. Now, oh, I just stopped right there. We got a 15. That was kind of fun. Now, what we're going to do is we are now going to look at the percentage of time because we've got well over 100 clicks now. I'm feeling pretty good about looking at a percent because a percent is going to be easier to, to look at, I think, than, than, other, um, than, than the fractions. So let's just call this column uh, percent. I'm just going to call it percent. I'm going to center everything too while we're at it. And and what we're going to do, we're going to learn a little bit of, a little bit of commands in uh, in sheets. We're going to go equals. Now, actually, before I get into this, to do a percent, we'd have to do 11 out of the total of 415. Well, we can make sheets do that. We can go equals. Whoops, 11. So I clicked on 11. Now yours might not say 11, yours might be something else. So whatever yours says. 11 divided by, and then you can type sum, and then click D, and it'll add all the numbers in D. And right there, and look at that, it says autofill. I love that, I love that. And if you want, you can select that and change it to a percentage. So now it's at 2.63%, and the other side of that coin is uh, is uh, 97.6. Uh, you know what, we'll leave it as, yeah, we'll leave it as two decimals, that's fine. I will make the font bigger though. There we go. Okay, and then you can just, you're gonna notice it's gonna keep on doing exactly what it does. It's gonna keep on, you know, it, it's randomly generating those last Powerballs and keeping track of how many there are. It was actually kind of fun as I was just saying that last one, a couple more popped in. Now what's gonna happen if you keep doing this it's the percentages are going to eventually stabilize. And that's what I'm really interested in. I'm interested in, in that percentage. How often, that was actually kind of funny to see that right there, a couple 15s just came in. Now yours, again, yours are gonna be very different than mine, most likely. But there's gonna be something that's not very different from mine. There's gonna be something that's not very different from mine. And the more trials you have, the better your value is gonna get. Okay, so what I want you to do is I want you to stop now, answer the next couple questions.